Hey crafty family, it's me and Tigger. And he is just, Tigger I said sit down. Come on, let's sit nice, okay? Sit nice. Good boy. Aunt Samantha sent you something and we're going to get to that in a second. So my friend Samantha sent me this enormous flipping box from, ne uh, from the Netherlands. And look, he can't keep his nose out of it. He knows. And what's funny is... I didn't know there was anything in there, but he knew before I did because, look, he was doing this to the box when I was opening it. He is just adamant that there's something in there for him. Did Aunt Samantha send you something? Did she? <laughs> did she send you something? This was a heavy box to be sending from the Netherlands. You gotta be careful with that shipping. It's expensive. Okay, let's see what Aunt Samantha got. For you what is this okay first we have to read it it has a doggy on it and it says bursting with flavor pick and mix mr good lad how cute and they're little tiny bones and such they're so cute i'm gonna put the camera down briefly so i can open these for him and give him one so you're gonna be viewing basically nothing for a minute sorry it's all white sorry that's the card all right, hold on, buddy. He's like, he wants these so bad, he can't take it. He's scratching at my leg. All right, hold on a minute. Oh, these are so cute, these little bones. Sorry, guys, about that. Focus, camera, focus. There we go. So these are the little bones. Some of them are two-tone colored. They're so cute. He's just like, look at him. He's like shaking. He can't take it. Okay, you need to sit down like a good boy. You need to sit down. You know the rule. There. Yeah. You're so excited you're choking. What do you want? He can't take it. Look at him. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. Relax. He's very excited, Aunt Samantha. He's so happy. I think there was something else maybe for him or... Let me see. No, I think that's for me. Okay. I think the rest is for me in there, but we're going to go to my desk. And open it it is blazing hot out there it is so hot that I only cleaned one of the two houses I had today I had two houses but it's 90 something degrees and it's disgusting it is so hot that I just got done with that house and said I gotta come home I'll do the other one tomorrow because luckily they're out of town are you still struggling with that one little cookie did you eat it is it good that's his baby doll right there. He was carrying that around earlier. He's just chewing away at it. It takes him a minute. But she sent me this card. I'll show you that. And she said that this was the very first thing that she's done. I think ever. Or the very first thing I made after years of no crafting. Um... And she made it for me. So I don't I guess I, I don't know if I inspired her to get back into crafting or what, but she made this for me after years of not crafting and she said she thought it was ugly. I'm like, hell no, this is really pretty. This is gorgeous. I love, love, love those little they're like, you know, like the boy and the girl kissing with the hearts above them. Isn't that adorable? This cutest thing ever. And then that butterfly is gorgeous. She must have beaded it and put all those beads in and the sparkles. It's beautiful. I don't know why you would say it's ugly. It's gorgeous. And I love this little handmade, it's like a metal kind of plaque thing. And look at him. He's like, yes, mother, I will have another. You want one more? Did you, do you, li did you like them? Yeah, between Aunt Kendra and Aunt Samantha, you're going to be even fatter than normal. He can't take it. Look at him. Are you singing? Can you say thank you? Say thank you. Thank you, Aunt Samantha. Say thank you. Thank you. Say thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Say thank you. He can't take it. He's saying thank you. That's his way. <laughs> well, I'm going to move this over to my craft desk, so I'll be back in a minute. Hey, crafty family. We are now at my desk, and we're going to go through the fabulous box that I got. From Samantha from the Netherlands and let me tell you I opened it and yes I did peek I peeked but 
Don't worry. I didn't peek entirely. I peeked a little bit. I had to. It was from the Netherlands. I couldn't wait. Okay, so first there's this, which first of all, how cool is whatever this is? It's kind of stretchy and it's like, I don't know if it's plastic, but it kind of feels like a plasticky, maybe not. Maybe it's like a woven-y, I don't know. But how cool is this? I just thought this was the coolest thing. I don't know what it is, but it's awesome. <laughs> and I know I can find uses for it. This would be cool to put on a canvas for texture. And then there's this really awesome paper that I wanted to say that this is Tyvek, but I don't know. She's going to have to tell me. It's got glitter all in it. I think I don't. Like, I don't want to say that she, I don't think she did this. I think this is actually how it comes. At least I'm guessing that. I don't think she put the glitter on it and the paint on it. I believe that this is how it comes. It feels like, kind of like Tyvek. Um, I don't know what it is. It does rip a little bit. I almost thought it was tied back because I try. I almost started to rip it and I, it didn't really like seem like it was gonna rip. But when I when I do it, it does. Like it will rip. So it's not as strong as tie back, but it feels like it's got tie back in it. I don't know, but whatever it is, it's awesome. So forget what it's made out of. It's awesome. The colors are really cool. It sparkles. It's just awesome. It's just plain and simple. It's awesome. And then look at this one. Look how sparkly that is. It's just so cool. I don't know what it is, but it's awesome. I don't know what it is, but I love it. It's like one of those things. And then this one's really cool. It's got texture. Like these flowers are like raised. And then it's got a very like soft coloring to it. Love it. So pretty. Would make a great book cover. Very cool. Okay, then there is this well, I don't know if I guess you can consider it a washi tape, but it's like um, gems or whatever. Bling, like a bling washi tape. It's very cool. I love it. I've never seen it in a roll like that. Very cool, very cool. And then she, um, the first thing she, I actually saw on in this box was this card. Isn't that beautiful? And this is where she has like a note to me in the card. And she was saying how this was the first card or craft that she has done in years and she made it for me and it's the very first thing she's done in years which I thought was amazing and it's beautiful and she even said it was ugly and I said no 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 it's not it's beautiful there's no way this is ugly um but that's what she wrote inside oh I know it's ugly no 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 it's gorgeous look at it and don't you just love the little inchworms right here who have the hearts coming out above them that's my favorite part I love the butterfly too, but I really love that. That was just the cutest thing ever. And then it's got this little thing right here that says handmade. Isn't that cute? It's like a little metal placky type thing. So cute. I love it. So adorable. I love homemade stuff. So, and then we've got, look at this. It's one of those wood trays with all the little wood pieces in it, but look how cute. It's got little tiny cell phones little scooters, bicycles, a trumpet, mustaches. These are like little shoes, sunglasses and hats. How adorable. And then I can take these out and use the wood tray as a mini little shadow box and do like and decorate it and alter it. That's really cool. Love that. Then this really floored me. Okay, so it looks like it would be just like a box. But it's not. It's a music box. And I didn't open the packaging yet, but I want to because it shows on the outside that it's got one of those ballerinas in it. I have to see if it actually does or just like, you know, like basically they use it as an example of what you can do to it. I really hope that there's the ballerina in it because when I was little, I used to have the music box with the ballerina. Most of us did when we were kids. And I just really need to know if that's inside because um, I waited and waited until I did the video. But I gotta know. I gotta know. I gotta know. Okay, please let it be in there. Oh, it is. I'm so excited. Yay. 
What's funny, even if it wasn't in there, somebody had given me one of these ballerinas, so I could have actually put it in there. <laughs> Isn't that cute? Oh my goodness, that's so cute. And then if you shut it, it should shut off. Or not. Oh, there it went, okay. <laughs> this is really cute. I can't wait to alter that. That's gonna be fun. Okay, and then there is a can. I'm saving the best for last, honestly. Wait, is this, yeah, not that. I'm gonna move that over. Okay, there's this little pad of paper. This box was pretty big and it was pretty heavy for her to be sending from the Netherlands. Crazy. Look at this paper, isn't that really cool? It's craft paper with different patterns on it. I love that one. They're all great. Love it. So cool. So cool. Okay, this is the can I want to open. Okay, this is the best. This is the best thing I've seen in a long time. <laughs> this is so awesome. Okay, so I did pull this out and kind of look at the outside. I did not look really in the inside. I just, well, I looked to make sure it wasn't food. That's all I did. Um, it says craft crap on it. She knows me awfully well. She put craft crap. So in other words, I can store my craft crap in here. And by golly, I'm going to store my craft crap in here. You bet your sweet ass I'm going to store my craft crap. But I love how she put craft crap. <laughs> it's so funny. And inside, and I love how she decorated it. Look at how cool it is. It's got like the little paper lace stuff and gems. And it even has a little S, a little monogram for my name. I love it. It's so cool. And it used to be some sort of can for something or other. But now, look what it has in it. Goodies! Look at this. Look at these. This is craziness. Look. Oh my goodness, these are so adorable. They're like those little Dutch shoes or whatever. And they're ceramic. And they're on this like wire that's kind of bendable. Isn't that cute? I'm going to hang these up for sure. These are adorable. So adorable. I love those. And look, a whole thing of little gems. Yay! I love gems. I have lots of gems, but I love them. I have different sizes. I don't think I have any that are that tiny, which is good. And look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. <gasps> what is this? Ooh, that's pretty. I've never seen anything like that before. Isn't that pretty? I'm asking you as if you're there. Answer me. <laughs> Isn't that pretty? And look at this very cool these are like studs with little is it they, they have gems in them yeah they're like studs with little gems in them how cool i've never seen anything like that before either oh this is so awesome and here's some just regular square like stud type of things these are really cool never seen anything like these either you have some cool stuff over there you also must have really dark hair Cause I got one of your hairs. It wouldn't it it wouldn't be right if I didn't get one of your hairs. You know how many packages I send out that have hairs in it? I'm sure because it just happens. Girls have hair. This is interesting. I've never ever seen this before. It's literally like plastic lace. Oh, I really like this. I like the way it smells. I love that smell. That plasticky smell, love it. You're probably all like, what? Are you insane? I love that smell, <laughs> I'm weird. This is really kind of cool. I've never seen anything like this. This is gonna be fun to play with. Hmm, what can we do with this? It's really cool, I don't understand it. Okay, you'll have to tell me, Samantha, what they use this for where you live like what is this normally used on or for because I mean it, 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 it I'm imagining that they specifically use plasticky kind of lace for something specific so I'm just wondering what do they use it for 
Because, like, you wouldn't use that to sew onto your clothes, obviously. So there's got to be some sort of use for it. I mean, I know I'm going to find uses for it, believe me. Look at this. This is a pretty color. I have, like, the black ones, and I have the, or the silver ones and the gold ones, but these are, like, a copper color. That's really cool. You have fun stuff over there. Uh-oh, what's that? Ooh, it's a roll of, like, duct tape, but it's called designer tape. And look at all the cool polka dots is on that. Ooh, I like it. I like the polka dots. That's groovy. I'm going to stick this stuff back in here just because I've got a couple other Happy Meals coming up after this one. So I don't want to get everything mixed up or cluttered onto my desk. But I'm so excited. I love little cans with goodies in it. It's fun! And then we've got, ooh, look at this tin. And she knows I like little tins and stuff, so she packed a lot of them in there. And she wrote, I don't know if she wrote that or if that was on there. It looks like handwriting, but I think it was on the tin. But this tin is really cool. I gotta say, this is probably one of the coolest tins I've ever seen. It's just really cool. Ooh, this has got goodies galore. <gasps> look at this. Look how cute that is. She made that. She made that top and everything. How cute is that? Oh, and it unscrews. That is really cute. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, she made the tiles. Look. Oh, she made nice little ones. Ooh, hers are pretty. Look at that one. That's gorgeous. Hers are pretty. Mine didn't come out this pretty. Hers are like really, really translucent and you can really see the cool colors. How come mine didn't come out that good? What did you do different? Look at this. She must have did something different. You have to share with me your secrets. Share with me your secrets. But look, there's a whole bunch of them that I'm dropping. Yay! Thank you very much for sharing your goodies. I really appreciate that you shared your goodies. Ooh! Ooh! Ah! Yay! She sent me some of these things, which I forget the name of. Eyelets. Yay! Love eyelets! And what are these? What are these? These are, are these snaps? Oh, they're snaps. They're metal snaps. Yay. Sweet. They're like little metal snaps. Sweet. I don't have no metal snaps. I have some plastic snaps, but not metal snaps. Look at this. And it has a piece, a piece I was going to say a piece of hole in it. It's got a piece of hole. Can you have a piece of hole? It's got a hole in it. So you can like make a, a big pendant with it or like an ornament and actually paint it. How pretty. It's nice and smooth. That'll be fun. There's all kinds of interesting stuff in here. I don't even know where to start. Okay, wait a minute. What is this thing? What is this? Book about you. I think it says about you. It either says about you or about 404. I think it's gonna, I think it's about you. Oh, it is about me, but it's so sweet. Look, this is so sweet. It says, Stacy, you are creative, smart. This is so adorable. Fun, honest, kind, loving and strong oh wait it goes on beautiful caring warm awesome crazy that's right <laughs> thank you for being you this is so cute like just the whole concept of this is just adorable thank you so much for this this is something i will treasure forever i love this the whole idea of this is just brilliant so cool thank you so much and thank you for the kind words you put in here that was so sweet this is just so sweet I love this I want it forever I'm gonna put it on my desk 
I'll like spread it out on the end of my desk if I have room. I'll make room. There will be room. That's just how it goes. I make the rules here. What is this? Look at this cool tin. Okay, that's a groovy tin. It's an old, like, I don't know how old it is. I, it looks to me like it's a bit old. I could be wrong. 20 sprints. So these are some sort of like a cigar type of cigarette, like the thinner cigars. I know that's not what's inside of here, but it used to be. Very cool. <gasps> Ooh. Much better than cigars. Look at all these beads. Somebody else gave me a few of these beads. And then you gave me some. I think she, the girl who gave me the beads the last time was from overseas somewhere. I can't remember offhand. So it's like you guys have these cute little beads. Aren't they adorable? I love these. Now I have lots of them and I love it. These are so cute little animals and the little teddy bears oh they're so cute oh look at this a little wooden flower look at all the little pom-poms they're sparkly Ooh, look at this it's a clip with a butterfly in a little clover or flower how cute Ooh, look at this I'm like look at this it's a dragonfly how cute Look at this, there's a flower. Look at this, there's a wooden heart, painted gold. Ooh, look at this, these are like those pearl, mother of pearl shells, I don't know what they are, but they're those things, you know what they are, those shell things. People make buttons out of them, you know what I mean, those things, aren't they cute? They're so cute, ooh, what's that? Ooh, what's that, I see something hidden, ooh. What is this? <gasps> Ooh. That's cute. Oh, wait a minute. These are all stickers. Huh. Look at that. Oh, yeah. They're all like stickers. Oh, how cute. They're like little pattern stickers. Okay. That's adorable. Adorkable. Oh, my goodness. This whole tin is filled with fun stuff little butterflies so cute and there's more wooden hearts and there's a whole bunch of charms and there's a little cross that's a pretty cross and there's a flower sticker and I know these because these are I have some of these on my door not this kind I have butterflies and you peel off the top of them and it it's got a protective coating over it because they're mirrored see right there I peeled off the little coating you could do that when you're ready to stick them so that they don't get scratched up. And look at these gears. We love some gears. These are cool. <gasps> There's lots of the gears in here. Look how cool. Steampunk time. I need to do something steampunk. Maybe I'll do it with this tin. That would be a cool thing to do it with. I said do it. <laughs> This is so cool. This is such an exciting package because every time I turn around, there's another package inside of a package. Okay, this is not gonna fit as well as you had it at all. And then there's this little piece of paper in there. I'm gonna put that in the trash. I don't think that goes to anything. Okay, I'm not gonna try to shut it all the way because it's just not gonna happen because she packed it way better than I did. Ooh, what is this? Oh, I think this is, oh yeah, it's, oh, it's sticky notes. Okay, we gotta see this. I love making sticky notes. Oh, I didn't have to do that. I could have just opened the cover. Dumbass. <gasps> Ooh, that's a really cool graphic. Avert your eyes if you don't like to see sexy women. That's a cool graphic, though. I really like that. Look at these little sticky notes. There's all these little flags here. There's notes here, notes here, and then this note. <gasps> love it. Very cute. Oh, uh, that's cute. Oh, you know where that can go? That can go in my little faux dory. That would be a cute way to store. I can just slip the cover through my little faux dory. And that's perfect. Awesome. 
And then we've, oh, yay. Oh my goodness. Irma Gerd, it's a poodle stamp. Now I have more than one poodle stamp. Actually, I have two currently, and this is the third. The other one goes with that little die, but I like my other one and this one certainly better because they just look more like poodles than that other little one. But this is so cute. Oh my goodness, it's so cute. Oh, I think this is my favorite poodle stamp. That's so cute. I love it so. And then we've got more wood pieces, already drilled holes in them. Easy to make stuff with them. Very cool. And then there is this cute little, which I think might have went around something. Maybe it went around this. No, I don't know. It went around something because it's like it just slipped off of something. I don't know what though. So, but I have it. I will keep it with everything. Okay, we're not done yet. We're not done yet, folks. There's still stuff in this. Ooh, this is like, it's not burlap. I don't think. Maybe it is burlap. No, it's more like a plasticky or something. It's something, it's not burlap though. It's made to look like burlap, but it's not actual burlap. It's not the material. It's more of a plasticky. That's really kind of cool. I kind of like that. Cause what's cool about it is it doesn't fray like burlap does. So that's pretty neat to have. And then there's this, a piece of green, kind of a, I don't know, like a ribbon maybe because it's sewn on both ends. It's kind of like a green wide ribbon. That's cool. I can cut flowers out of that. Leaves. I can cut leaves out of that. Do I have a leaf dye? I don't think I do. Well, I can cut them by hand. That would make good leaves. Okay, let's see what else. I'm gonna say, still saving the best for last, so we're not there yet. Almost. Okay. Ooh, look at this napkin. <gasps> Ooh, I've never seen one like that with all the little cupcakes. Ooh, how cute. Ooh, this one's cute too. Oh, I like this. I could see myself cutting out these shapes, like the word love and then cutting out the hearts and the little squares. That's groovy. Ooh. I, you know, I used to have this as a wallpaper border in one of my one of my houses. I put it up in my bedroom or my office or something, but it was this, like the angels, and it was like a wallpaper border. So that kind of reminds me of that. It's cute. Oh, look. See, it had that angel and that angel next to each other on the wallpaper border. Cute. And then this one, pretty black and white flowers. And this one that says, be happy. It says it right here, be happy. I really like this one. That's so cute. Ooh, I like this one a lot. That one's really pretty with the feathers. You have cool napkins over there. Ooh, and these are flowers are pretty. Very pretty. Ooh, count how many times I say ooh because I, I think I've said it like 9,000 times. Look at this. This is awesome. This butterfly's got like a map going through it. And this one's out of like text and music notes. I really like this one a lot. That's going to be fun to play with. That one's pretty too. Sunflower. Is that a sunflower? I think it's a sunflower. Yeah, that's a sunflower. Very pretty. Ooh, red and white polka dots. It looks like one of those bandanas it even has the texture in it. I don't know if you could tell on there, but it has that kind of fabric-y texture. Very cute. Ooh, the roses. Very cute. Love those. Ooh, fancy. Fancy pants. <gasps> oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, this is my favorite all-time napkin of ever of all time ever of space and time continuum space of ever of all time universe space infinity. That's my favorite napkin. I don't know if I expressed that well enough. Maybe I should do it again. No, but yes, that is my favorite napkin. <laughs> that is so awesome. Oh, you have the best napkins officially. 
the Netherlands has the best napkins. That's really pretty too. And ooh, this one's really pretty too. This one's really poofy and like, it's like, it's like puffy. Isn't that cute? That would definitely make a nice journal cover. And these are like cherry blossoms. Ooh, I love it. Very cute. Foam glitter vellum. <laughs> glitter vellum. <laughs> Foam glitter vellum. Did I say that right? That's funny. I'm not going to pull these out because they'll shed. And I just cleaned off my desk. <laughs> but that's really cool because I love having those because these are fun to die cut and make stickers out of. You could die cut shapes and make stickers. And what is this fun? <gasps> what is this? Oh my goodness, this looks really fun. I'm gonna have to open this. This looks like way too much fun. Way too much fun. Holy moly. Oh, wait. <gasps> it's material. Oh my goodness. Oh my gird. I am so making journals out of these, big time. <gasps> These are awesome. How did you ever part with these? I will hoard these forever and make journals out of them, but I will hoard them most of all. These are flipping awesome. How would you ever part with such beautiful things? I seriously, like there's four of them and they're that, they're all that big. I won't take them all apart, but this one's got, it's like a newspaper, kind of. Yeah, this one's kind of like a newspaper print. That is so cool. And this one's got kitty cats on it. Oh, they're so cute. Oh, that is so adorable. Oh, and this one's got little, like a vintage-y, kind of a, it says bonjour, I guess paris -y. The little bird. This one's really pretty. They're all beautiful. Just it's probably like the most beautiful fabrics I've ever owned. Thank you so much. These are so pretty. Oh my goodness. Okay. So now the best part. I'm moving stuff out of the way because I need a wipe really quick because there is some debris from glitter and such. Glitter and such, that's just how it goes. When you open a box, you get glitter surprises. I'm okay with that. All right, so I had set this can, this adorable can with windmills. Windmills, what is a windmill? Is that where you just go and suck wind and eat it? Pretty much. Hold on a second, I'll be right back. Okay, sorry, I'm back. Uh, Tigger started barking and I wanted to shut him up before I continued. Okay, so this fabulous tin with these awesome windmills, which are so perfect for considering where they've come from. I love that. I love that I have a piece of where she's come from with these different elements. They're just awesome. So anyway, she also sent me, and I think this is the first time besides a piece of chocolate that I've ever gotten any kind of food. So it's very exciting to me that there's food to try. Very exciting, very, very exciting. This is so exciting. <laughs> you have no idea. I can't read it, I have no idea. Oh wait, it does say, store in a cool dry place, best before 11, 12, 2016. Netherlands, Amsterdam, the Netherlands. So, and okay. It says Stroop, Stroop Waffles. I don't know if I said that right, probably not. And I see it says Caramel Wafers. Now let me tell you something, the smell that is coming out of this package makes me drool. I can't take it. It smells like waffles, maple syrup, and butter with cinnamon. It's killing me. It's just killing me. Okay, so we're gonna open the package because all it's holding it together is a twist tie. So that's why I was able to smell it. And it was such a tease because, ugh, because I opened this tin and smelt everything coming out of it. And I was like, oh, I have to do this video soon because I need to eat this. I need to eat it now. <laughs> so I'm going to try it. And no, you're not going to be able to see my face. 
um, because, yeah, I don't look like anything that anybody should have to endure at this moment. But you'll hear my, my response. Ooh, these are heavy. These are heavy and thick and soft. <gasps> oh, I love things that are soft. Okay, I'm going to try it. So, okay. Mmm, num, num, num. Oh my god, these are so good. It doesn't help that I have a toothache right now. I don't care. I don't care that I have a toothache. On my, I had a toothache the last time on my right side, and this time I have it on my left side. That's always fun, right? These are so good. I've never tasted anything like it. I mean, the flavor is that of like breakfast. But the taste in my mouth and the texture is nothing like I've ever had. It's so good. And my friend Karen, I'm talking with a mouthful. My friend Karen said she's from Holland. I want to say Holland. Supposedly she's sending me goodies from Holland. Now here's the thing. If I'm not mistaken, I could have sworn that she said something about that in one of her videos. She's sending me goodies. I don't know what she's sending me. She said she was going to send me goodies and something to try. I don't know if she was sending me these, but I know in a video that she made with, it was like a giveaway video, she said something about, I want to say they were these type of things, stroop waffles or whatever. I remember this for some reason. It clicked. It clicks in my head. So maybe this is what she was talking about in her video. But then we had gotten to talking, and so apparently she's sending me a goodie box. And I don't know if she's putting these in here, but I will be very appreciative to have more because I'm a glutton pig, and I will probably eat all of these in a day. That's how good these are. Like. I can't even, I can't even. You just need to find these somewhere. Like, online? Can you get them online? I'm such a pig. I'm <laughs> okay, here's what I'm going to suggest. Look up Stroop Waffles. It's not that hard of a spelling. Look that up and see if you can find them because I'm telling you, you've got to get some of these. I'm going to put them down for now. Trust me, I'm going back to them in a little while. I, I, I'm not the type to fake something. If I don't like it, you're going to know. If I like it, you're going to know. <laughs> All right, I'm going to wipe the crumbs away. That was probably one of the best things I've ever tasted. It was the perfect consistency for me because I don't like really hard things. That's what she said. I, I don't like really super crunchy things unless it's like a chip and even then I like uh, the thinner the better so that it's not like so crunchy that it hurts my teeth. Okay, so next there is these which are another very heavy type of cookie but to me without tasting them they remind me of maybe a butter cookie. I can't read them. It says Baker's Speculas Vulgin traditional recept. I'm imagining that these are like a traditional, like, um, Amsterdam, um, Netherlands treat. I don't know. I'm not good with geography, so I know Holland and the Netherlands and all that are in the same area. I don't know how much they share food. So, like, I know these waffle things, I said that Karen, um, she um, was talking about them, but I don't know if it's the same thing. She'll let me know in the video, I mean in the comments, if it was, if that's similar to what she was talking about in her video. If it is, then Karen, you need to send me some more because I'm going to eat all of those. 
Okay, so I just picked this up and put it to my nose just to smell it. By the smell, they almost smell gingerbread -y. Which, oh, I see, they're individually packaged. I hope these aren't dog cookies. I have to make sure they're people cookies. They've got to be people cookies. They don't show any pictures of pets. Okay, I don't, I think they're people cookies. Because you know, like, sometimes dog cookies and people cookies will look alike sometimes? Yeah. And I can't read anything on there, so just saying. I think the cookies that Tigger got were the cookies that he, these are very crumbly. Okay, ready? I'm going to try one. Yeah, they, they're definitely like a gingerbread-y type of thing. Mmm. 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 Yep. I like these. These are like a sugar cookie. Mmm. Mmm. -hmm. These are yummy. They're like if a gingerbread cookie and a sugar cookie melds together. So good. Mm-hmm. They're a little bit more crunchy, but they're still good. They're not like super crunchy, but they're a little crunchy. Mmm, these are yummy. Okay. I want to eat more. Mmm. -hmm. I guess this was the bottom one, so it got broken. All right. I'm not going to eat all of it yet. Those dang waffles are going to be gone real fast. This country needs to get on the ball. We need some struvel, struvel waffles or whatever the heck it's called. I'm making a big old mess. Okay. There's one more. I don't know about this one. Okay, they look like black Swedish fish. And the only thing I can think of is that they are a Swedish fish, but they're licorice. The only thing I fear is that they're actually fish. Like they're, they've got fish flavor in them, which I doubt they're candy. I don't think that she would be that mean to me, Samantha, to send me fish flavored candy. No, I think they're, I think they're black licorice Swedish fish is what I think. I don't know because I can't read any of this. And there's like no English on here whatsoever. But my teeth hurt, so I gotta be careful. So I'm only gonna take a little bite because I know these are very chewy and I don't wanna hurt my teeth. Wow, these are weird. They smell weird. They smell like black licorice a little bit, but not like, it's not like the traditional black licorice that you would get here. These are less sweet smelling kind of. This is what it looks like. It's like a black Swedish fish. We have Swedish fish here, the red ones. Let me, all right, I'm gonna bite a little bit of the tail off. Okay. No, I don't like that. I don't like that at all. <laughs> okay, yeah, no, I don't like that. But I'm gonna have to give some to Chris. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that did not, that was not pleasurable at all. That was bizarre. Maybe it does have real fish in it. Yeah, that, I think these are like a, these are probably like a really traditional treat there. And they're just gross. But I'm sure she put them in there just to give me something so that she can laugh at me when I taste it. And I did taste it, thank you very much, and I don't like them. But I'll find somebody who does, or I'll find somebody I don't like and give them a whole bunch. So, it's a win either way. Yeah, I'm glad I only took a little bite. But, holy crap, these two are awesome, definitely. These are something I can eat until my eyes pop out. I can definitely eat these. So, I will be doing a lot more of that, especially when my tooth feels better. So thank you so much. Thank you so much, um, Samantha, for this amazing package. It was just amazing. It had everything. It had something for Tigger. It had something for me to snack on. It has all kinds of craft stuff. This was awesome. And best of all, it had something handmade from you, a couple of things that were handmade from you. And I really appreciate that. 
so thank you so much this was so sweet and actually I think I'm going to leave this video as this because it's already like 45 minutes long and then I'll do the other two happy mails in another video right after this so uh, and the next video right after this one will be more happy mail so thank you so much Samantha thank you to everybody that's watching let me know if you have had Stroopwafels or Spectaculars whatever those cookies are or these weird disgusting fish have you had any of these have you tried them which one do you like which one do you, if you haven't had them which one do you think you'd like um, make sure you subscribe to my channel make sure you give me a thumbs up don't give me a thumbs down because that kind of sucks even if you don't like my video you don't have to thumb it down you could just not like it in your head <laughs> make sure you do what you love and love what you do and be nice to people love you guys bye